the foundation be destroyed, what can the righteous do? What can the righteous person do? The Bible also says in the book of Psalm that the tree of the righteous is the tree of life. Have you ever seen a bad tree producing good fruit? So with this, I welcome you to another topic called Dream About Tree. Dream About Tree. The importance of tree can never be overemphasized. When we are talking about tree, then tree is connected to environment. Tree is connected to a man's health. Tree is connected to a man's blessing. Symbolically, in the dream world, there are different types of tree. We have the tree of life, as the Bible says in the book of Genesis, and we have the tree of darkness, which is the tree of the serpent. And you know, anybody that eats from that tree of the serpent, that person is liable for divine punishment and death. Now, symbolically, when you wake up from a dream about tree and your emotion is cool, your emotion is stable, you don't feel threatened, then it can represent a number of many. Number one, it represents prosperity. Number two, it represents fruitfulness. Number three, it represents productivity. Number four, it represents breakthrough. Number five, it represents good news. Number six, it represents fruit of the womb. Number seven, it represents sound sources. Number eight, it represents speeding promotion. Number nine, it represents marital breakthrough. Then number ten, it represents business growth and turnaround. That is when you wake up from a dream about tree, you feel relaxed. Nothing is shaking you. Then when you wake up from a dream about tree, you feel terrified. You feel fearful. You feel as if something bad is about to come. Then it can represent the number of meaning. Number one, it represents poverty. Number two, it represents hardship. Number three, it represents barrenness. Number four, it represents miscarriage. Number five, it represents constant delay. Number six, it represents profitless ad labor. Number seven, it represents sorrow and weeping. Number eight, it represents backwardness and retrogression. Number nine, it represents demotion and impossibility. Then number ten, it represents close doors. When you wake up from a dream about three and you feel terrified, you feel you are not okay, something bad is about to come, it can represent those minutes. Three is made up of branches, it's made up of stems, and these ones are connected together. In order to what? In order for that tree to grow. Meaning that the branch and the stem, they support themselves in order to grow. In the real life, we have family. Family is made up of a man, a woman, children. But if these ones connect themselves together, it brings family breakthrough, family deliverance, family restoration, family liberation, whatever names you might call it. Then when we are talking about tree, then tree as a symbol on itself, it represents family, one. It represents personality, two. It represents idol. I have interpreted dreams based on that idol, idol tree. We all know this. We all, we all know Iroko tree, one of the tallest trees so far. But when you are seeing Iroko tree in your dream, then it signifies a strong man. So, dream interpretation is best interpreted by your emotion. So, when you feel unstable, then you mean that something, the enemy, is planning against you, which is an attack. You have to start canceling those attacks. Now, when you are dreaming, where you are plugging fruit from a tree, you are plugging fruit from a tree, then that signifies sources. That signifies that you are aiming at 
a particular thing, project. Maybe you are trying to get away from a particular place, but you are aiming at a different level. It means your effort to achieve something. It means your effort to make advancement. It means your effort to be to become a great person in your family because you are trying to pluck something on that tree but when you pluck that thing it means your effort has really paid out for you it means whatever you have been working for is making a lot of success and is bringing good news on your part it's just like when somebody's in an organization you have been working working for years working for years but later all of a sudden your boss now says it is now time for me to favor you then in that aspect is signify God as remember you because you are actually plugging front on a tree which is a good tree now at the same time in the process where you are plugging that tree you plug that tree and somebody somewhere took away those fruit from you if you are a woman it signify loss of blessing if you are a woman who is expecting a child a pregnancy it means that somebody somewhere is attacking you the front of your womb and if you are a man you are plugging front on the tree and somebody came and stole that front then it means that your harvest has been taken away then in some cases you saw tree with that with that tree with that front with that not producing leaves not producing front that signify barrenness. That signify suffering. That signify poverty. That signify debt. That signify unfruitfulness. That person, that tree, represents a human being who is not producing fruit, who is not responsible, who is not responsible. A person who is not responsible in the family, maybe the person is jobless. It's not the person is unable to take over the responsibility of his family so you have to pray that any power that is attacking the staff of my bread that let that power be destroyed in the name of jesus christ maybe in in another way you dream where you dream about dead branches dead branches when a branch is dead in that dream it represents one's foundation when that branch is dead it means you're operating on a faulty foundation. A faulty foundation is translated to demonic causes. A faulty foundation is translated to demonic covenant. A faulty foundation is translated to family generational inheritance. A faulty foundation, it means that uh, there, is a, there is a particular thing that is hovering around a particular trend that is hovering around the family that is affecting the destiny because when the foundation of a house is not strong automatically that house will come down so when that tree is dead it means the, the, the foundation of that family is not strong so this is the time for the family that needs to rise up and pray against demotion against delay against hardship against shame against disappointment praise the living jesus why what are the causes of a person having the dream about tree in a negative perspective what are the causes the negative perspective then number one it could be sin number two it could be faulty foundation number three it could be stubborn covenant and causes number four it could be it could be polygamous witchcraft number five it could be family evil inheritance number six it could be high rate of bloodshed and sacrifice in that family so those are the things that can trigger that dream about tree in a negative mood in a negative emotion so what are the way out what are the way out if you discover that you are feeling you're not feeling right you're not feeling good concerning this dream what are the way out of this number one you give your life to christ be a friend of jesus give your life to christ establish a relationship between you and god for sure you have to repent from every known sin every sin every sin that a man commits 
it's an abomination not to God. And number three, you have to take time and deal with your foundation. You have to deal with your foundation. Number four, you have to separate yourself from a demonic environment. Three, some, three dream has to, can also has to do with environment. You have to separate yourself from demonic environment. Then number five, number five, then you have to take time and break every demonic covenant, every demonic causes. Then number six, number six, number six way to come out from this is you have to barricade yourself with the power and the fire of the Holy Ghost. You barricade yourself so that the Lord will protect you and your family together. And I pray for you, the Lord will deliver you from every stubborn problem in your father's house and your mother's house in Jesus' name. So the instruction behind this dream, number one, you have to embark on seven days prayer and fasting. Embark on seven days prayer and fasting between 6 a.m. to 3 p.m. 6 a.m. to 3 p.m. 6 a.m. to 3 p.m. So you have to take time. Use the Bible verse, Obadiah chapter 1, verse 17, Psalm 70, Psalm 35, Psalm 27. Then number chapter 23, verse 23, Matthew chapter 15, verse 13. Use those Bible verse to pray. And I pray with you today in the name of Jesus Christ. Every ancestral tree, every stubborn tree in your life that is following you anywhere you go, I command that tree to die by fire in the name of Jesus. I want you to close your eyes. Say this prayer point loud and clear. Say, every ancestral battle in my family die. In the name of Jesus, every ancestral battle in my family, die in the name of Jesus. Die, die, die. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. You are going to pray this prayer upon loud and clear. Say, witchcraft foundation. I am not your candidate. Da, 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 da. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say, every plant my father has not planted in my life. Every plant my father has not planted in my home. Every plant my father has not planted in my marriage. Every plant my father has not planted in the life of my children. Be uprooted by fire. Be uprooted by fire. Be uprooted. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say this prayer upon loud and clear. Say generational causes. Generational sickness. Generational hardship. Generational setback. Affecting my progress, break by fire, break by fire, break by fire, break by fire, break by fire. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Say poverty, hardship, suffering in my foundation. I shake you out. 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 In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. You are going to shout this prayer point loud and clear. Say inherited family battles say inherited family battles i separate myself i separate myself i separate myself i separate myself in the name of jesus in jesus name we pray amen take this last say oh god arise make me a fruitful man make me a fruitful woman in the name of jesus oh god arise make me a fruitful man make me a fruitful woman in my family in my generation in my country in my environment in my society in the name of jesus in the name of jesus open your mouth and pray that prayer point open your mouth and pray that prayer point in jesus name we pray amen so i've taken that prayer congratulations the lord will deliver you from every ancestral evil foundation in the name of jesus if after the prayers you are seen having negative symptoms negative feelings about the tree then this is the right time for you to go for your deliverance so i want you to go for your deliverance at mountain of fire at prayer city take your time and go for your thorough deliverance there for the lord almighty to deliver you from every stubborn battle hard battle and every ancestral 
retrogression and backwardness and i pray for you today in the name of jesus christ the egyptian you see today in your family you shall see them no more in jesus christ in jesus name we pray amen and amen so if this broadcast has blessed you so invite your friends invite your family and invite your enemies to subscribe to this channel please and please write your dream about three at the comment section we will respond to it once again this is evangelist joshua broadcasting from lagos nigeria remain blessed see you at the top